one guy on the back end for the Flyers who's been great all year long. It's his defense core now, Travis Sanheim, and the departure of Ivan Provorov. Sanheim is close to 26 minutes tonight. There's a confidence to his game that is noticeable. Let's see if he can have a big game here tonight against Carolina. Play hard, they play below the goal line, and better be ready to compete. Beth Agle shot, puck kept away from Spetsnikov by Samula. Reflected out by Travis Konechny. Puck knocked down in the neutral zone by Delpedio. Score! What a shot by Tippett. From the top of the right circle, just a minute, 50 seconds in. Owen Tippett with his fourth in the last three games. He gets into the neutral zone, then forces a turnover, and then a quick play. Belpedio moves it up. Watch a quick pass right there. And all of a sudden ends up in the back of the net. Beautiful quick transition as Frost sets the table and Tippett. I think he surprises the goaltender there, Bruce Kotekov. He does. He does, but also, too, watch Belpedio. Watch his... He, he goes right in the sight lines of Kotekov. Flyers 7-1 when they score first this season. Frost and Belpedio with the assists. Frost coming off a two-goal game. He's been in and out of the lineup. Save made by... Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. That ball. ever happened to you, Bruce? Did you get the double whammy there? Uh, I don't recall that, no. Some rust on a goaltender's game when you re-enter the lineup, and you know with Carolina, they're going to throw everything at the net, so you're oh. going to be busy. And boy, that is a big save early on on this feed by Stahl to Martinook. Sometimes you need a little bit of luck on your side, too. Konechny comes away with the puck for the Flyers. Taken away by Tessie. And now the Hurricanes clear the zone. Oh. Into the Flyers and it's Shea, gloved by Hart. And he's been shooting the puck a lot more in recent games for the Flyers from the back end. He's been a real nice surprise for the Flyers so far this year. Oh, good save there. Redirect. Failing. And Rod Brindamore admitted this morning that it's still a work in progress with some of the new guys, but there's no doubt, I think, over the long haul, some of those changes made in the offseason is going to be for the better of this Hurricanes team. Say that a lot here in Carolina. Yes, they do. Still think one. Oh, look out here. There's an opportunity for Cook to the Emmy. Turned aside by Hart. Exiting the zone. This puck has got to get out. Try to make a quick little play. Cook in the Emmy with the quick stick, and then he tries to go blocker side and Hart with a beautiful stop. Uh, big save for Hart. Uh, he timely saves, right? And Zamula, who Zamula, a little bit more simple. Just use the wall. Trying to beat Koke and Niemi there and ran himself into a little bit of trouble, but his goaltender bails him out. They should in front. Oh, oh, oh. Off the redirect from Drury. It's a hard. Mason finds Drury for redirect. Stopped by the Philadelphia goaltender. Uh, including North America uh, and Canada. We do an awful lot of research in Canada as well. Which fetch the cost back out. Jarvis for the shot. That stopped and covered up. Another uh, another feather in the cap of both the Beef Foundation and the National Hockey League. Appreciate it. Uh, ho uh, you know, in hockey, uh, we might pick a team, but, but cancer doesn't pick a team. We are all on one team in this fight to achieve victory over cancer. You make sure you're on your toes. He was ready for that play. He knew that Drury was there. Maybe nobody else did, but Hart certainly knew he was there, and he came up with the big save. There's the Laurier covered up. Under five to play, first period. one nothing Flyers. Owen Tippett with the goal, his 100th National Hockey League point. So think about some of the saves we've seen in this game, and there's another one there for Hart. He's going to burn. Burns made a really good defensive play there and kept the Flyers from getting a breakaway. Burns looking for the redirect, did not connect. Now Slavin with a drive, that's gloved. And uh, Svetnikov ends up getting hurt and didn't play a lick. Here's Couturier dropping it back off. Konechny moving in with oh, a shot. Is that off the mask? Yeah. Another nice touch play here by Konechny. He, he did it on the first goal as well. A nice little kick out to Couturier and then Konechny trying the short side. And, yeah, you can tell that was calculated by Kochekov. You can't get your glove up, so get your head on it. That was an old school style save there, like Brian Boucher. No, I never did that. Uh, Dominic Hasek was the guy that started to do that. I never well, understood I'm, I'm, it. Okay, I'm not saying using your head because you don't use it very often, but I'm saying positionally, the way you were standing, you were yeah. standing in a net, I'm like, wow, there's some, some room down low there. And we used to see it's those terrible. type saves. Well, you know what I meant. It might have came out, you know, the way I wanted to, but, you know. The goalie union well represented. Yeah. I mean,
Only chance I'll get into the Hall of Fame is by visiting it. Uh, I swore that would be the last time I play, but I got roped into another alumni game in January in Philadelphia, so. Who scored on you last year? Oh, everybody. <laughs> Wendell Clark, uh, you name them, they got them. <laughs> Look towards the net, Couturier, now back for connecting. Unfortunately, Couturier was down on his knees there. What a play by Walker, all started by the excellent play One by Connecting. Sheeler, score! Redirected in front by Konechny! 2-0 Philadelphia! Well, we talked about the hard work of the Philadelphia Flyers, and this shift is absolutely a blueprint. Went wide initially on this shift, and then he just win puck battles, and they make plays. Look at his breakdown defensively for Carolina. Sealer with the shot pass on the ice. And that's one of those you just dream about, Bush, is a forward in front of the net where this thing, all you got to do is open up that bottom hand and that stick blade, and you elevate the puck. And the Flyers are taking a page out of Carolina's book. Early in this game, make sure the turnovers aren't there and get more pucks to the net. Yeah, they went through a little stretch there for about, you know, two minutes where they were, you know, turning the puck over. And Carolina's going to have that ability to be able to do it. Not sure why the goal light is still on in behind for checkoff, but... You know, Carolina is going to give you problems because they forecheck in the way that they play. But for the most part, I mean, this has been a a really, really impressive, solid period for the Flyers. Connecty's tenth of the season from Sealer and Couturier at 1902. And let's not forget a couple of the obviously big time saves by Carter Hart because this. Oh, Kochekov for the big stop for the closing seconds of the period. Big time save. He's playing for a poke check too, Edzo. He's a righty, yeah. so he takes it to his backhand. The stick is ready for a poke check. Tippett sees that, so he tries to go. Oh. Wow. We got him. <laughs> Beautiful. Great to see Harper here at the game tonight. Second period is underway with the Flyers leading the Hurricanes. At first, good start by the Flyers, and they went through a tough stretch where Carolina kind of took it to them. And we're managing the puck very well, and in the last two or three minutes, the Flyers kind of found their game again. And it is now 3-0 Philadelphia. Ryan Kaling, first of the season. What a pass here by Sean Walker. You talk about a quick developing play. Orloff has it, turns it over. Here comes Walker, makes the pass, and then backhand, forehand, roof shot by Paling. What a play. And a good play by Lawton, too, uh, along the wall to consecutive game. Passes Craig Ramsey, eighth on the all-time list. And second among defensemen, trailing only our Keith Yandel in the studio tonight. Brady Shea in deep, dropping it back off. Across it comes for Pepsi. Natchez, rink wide pass. Shea with a shot, turned aside by Hart. Up cleared out by Delorier of Philadelphia. Orloff back to retrieve. Orloff up the left side. Here come the Hurricanes back into the flyer zone. D'Angelo back across. Score! Nation! The Hurricanes are on the board. Wow, you think about what could have been for Shires about 45 seconds prior. Couturier turns down a breakaway pretty much and then watches pass, pass by Tony D'Angelo and Nason does exactly what you need to do. Top shelf, no chance for Hart, looks like crossbar and in. Fighting along with everybody else that's out there that's in the battle. And we also acknowledge a colleague of ours who is not here after a brave battle with cancer, Pete Smith was an audio technician here in the Raleigh area, worked all the Canes games at PNC Arena. He is immortalized with a photo. Both Miami pressed to the boards by Volpedio. He's had himself a good night. Here's Konechny across. Forster with a shot. And the save by Kuchetko. It starts with the play by Couturier here. Just to kind of chip it past to open space. Allows for the odd man rush. And trying to shoot it back where Kuchetkov is coming. Wins over the Ducks, Kings, and now the Hurricanes. They will head home and host Vegas on Saturday. Flyers end an eight-game losing streak to Carolina. Philadelphia with a 3-1 victory.